getting your instruction in the dressing room and just have a good, clean fight. Listen to my command. Protect yourself at all times. Good luck. From Inouye, underlines the fact that power behind the jab, like you just mentioned, so that's definitely an asset. Behind the jab on a classic one-two. He says his best punch is hook, and he hasn't unfurled that one quite with one. But you can see the... Nieb is quite aware that he's up against a guy who's regarding this fight because they have such glowing things. A long time to learn. He has a reputation. So a couple of times, in a leads with the left hook. Well, he's fundamentally sound. And that power... He has an idea of what he wants to do in there. We trying to also punch with in the way. I, think, I just don't know if he can translate that physically. Tries to deliver the body. In a way, did a great job. Faints and faints and... To get his shot in there first. And this is where Inoue has had his way so far. So. To land his own shot. Because obviously you can get caught with a clean shot. Good shot. Let Nieves to the body and he followed up in a little bit wide. Amateur fight. So he has had one knockdown scored against him. Although that's his game. End this round. Now he goes downstairs and comes back up. There's and vicious left hand to the body from Inouye. She's a 115 pounder, boy. Won the first fight for Juan Francisco Estrada. It was maximizing the power in his punches in the second. And that's the same thing you see with Inouye. He's always in position to punch, regardless of what his opponent did. He bothered Nieves with that hard right hand off the jab. Nieves trying to come back with some body shots. Looking, waiting, and he launches again. When one guy is coming up from below the flyweight division, and the other guy is coming down from the hunt pounds. You know, the question here is, can Inouye impose... Just a little bit. Left hand to the body. Placement rather than power. Now combinations. Ten seconds! Ten seconds! Oh, he thought it was the bell. In a way, he heard the, the ten second warning clap and thought it was the bell. That saved Nieves right there. Ah. Round three of a schedule 12. You can see that Harold Letterman unofficially, not surprisingly, winning the first two rounds. Nieves was hurt in that last round. He always called the monster. When a guy has fast hands, he just did something you a up can do. He saw the target and it could lift over the top and get it down to the base. It's kind of classic technical defense. You think that'll be a problem against the next level? That will be a problem down the stretch if he continues to fight the mid-30s. He'll have to make those adjustments. Talking a lot about the power of anyway, but as he mentioned earlier in the broadcast. When he throws it. Oh, and it sets up our discouraging to Nieves. Well, you can happen toward the end of the last round, and you can see Nieves. Sometimes a game plan can go out the window quick. All of a sudden, it's no, you're getting hit heavy with heavy shots to the head and the body. Position on his feet, and he throws when he wants to. Pick him type puncher. He'll throw a jab, he'll throw a lead. He's a pick him type puncher until he gets his guy hurt, and then he throws in combination. I like it. This is just a brilliant round. This this was a one side right now. I mean, Nieves is a tough kid, but he is taking a lot of position because <laughs> when you're in the position to appeal to his heart, do you motivate? It's a tough and un in, in one way for Nieves. He works at a PNC as his banking career goes forward, and he said, Anoye, uh, anyway, it seemed to me to allow Nieves to throw some punches. I think that was by design. I don't know if Inouye was resting or if he was trying to lift the, the punishment from the previous round. With in an exchange oh, and any other top fighter in the sport an average of 37 coming in he's throwing 41 jabs per round here tonight oh or they implode right before us uh, putting Nevis away here in this round or next and really look devastating make some water cooler buzz the next you know on monday at work and if he scores a knock and do that but what, what I'm trying to slip away to the side, slip away, king him down, gets him into position here in a way, has him ready to go to the body. Yep, there it is. Oh, first time down Six, as a pro for Nieves. First time eight, in the ring with a nine. fighter. He'll protect the head, but the body can... In a way, stalking. There it is. Another body. Other than a hook to the body. And there's another one. one and there's another one. Uh, anything. Another left hook to the body. Listening to what Max Kellerman and Andre Ward say. Took to the body. Another left hook to the body. Exactly the prescription offered by in boxing. I don't care who you are, who you're Ten fighting, seconds. where you've been brought up. Arturo Gatti against Leonard Doreen. Did pray in front of him. 
a damaging, damaging thing to do. Like how much from Inouye only having 13 fights. Oh. Good right hand gets that shot. He's got to switch it up. Throw. That's what he did. He threw the right to the body. And there's well, Nevis. Nevis looked at him like, wait a minute, you're allowed there's to do that. There's another left hook to the body. Listen to the sound when those oh. left hand body shots that all over the arena here at the stub hub. I, I know he's not dazed in a way like he's a but wider and over and over the sledgehammer left to the body you can see Nieves is keeping that right hand glued to his side right there that's why you got to switch it up if you want that shot you got to go away and then come back to it and with the chance to put on a show now I know I'm a star you're going to see big things from me in the ring come to me come to me I'm ready for the knockout right now the referee has to get keep a close look on Nieves in a minute yeah, this corner said, hey, I'll stop it if it gets to... No, he's not. You need to stop it now. Do you need to see your guy unable to rise from the canvas? The contest is over. It's not a contest anymore. Yeah, this came in with a record of 17-1-2. His first loss in the last fight was a... Yeah, it's like he's still in the fight, but if you know what you're looking at, worse as this fight progresses. Big right, right hand, hand to the body. From in a way right what a vicious shot. Who knows Thanks what's going that's on that's internally that's in his ribcage. Another left of the body to finish the round, and Nieves staggers back to his corner, where trainer Joseph Delguide has a decision to make. And he has made the decision. So it'll be a technical knockout at the end of round six. For now, in a way, his 12th knockout in 14 fights. And we were told to expect something special. That was quite a show. Yeah, this is corner stopped it. That's